starting with 1 million luck points. Chapter 141, What? Are you afraid? The other supernatural experts hurriedly said, Yes, Senior Shi. Shi Ji looked at Han Pi Yu. You will be in charge of ensuring the safety of the 60 students who got the spots. If there's anything you need, just tell me. This is the first time I've established a training camp. I believe the other departments in the base will also cooperate. Yes, I'll get them settled as soon as possible. Han Pi Yu nodded heavily. Shi Ji looked at the supernatural expert surnamed Wang. How is the progress on the other facilities in the training camp? The supernatural expert surnamed Wang hesitated for a moment and replied, Senior Shi, the land space in the city is currently rather limited. Isn't it too wasteful to build small villas for the top ten? Shi Ji's gaze turned cold. I want my training camp to have all the facilities of the other training camps. Our facilities even have to be better. Understood, I'll supervise it now. At the Dark God's headquarters. Ever since the destruction of the Huadong city had failed, the Dark Gods had not sent any spies to infiltrate the Huadong city. Moreover, the demon race, the insect race, and the machine race had also stopped sending their high-level overlords to lead beast wave attacks on the Huadong city. It was as if they had agreed to ignore Huadong city altogether. President, do we really have to do this? A nervous voice sounded from under a black shadow. The Dark God's president, who was covered in a mask, said coldly, What? Are you afraid? The dark figure hurriedly said, President, it's not that I'm unwilling to part with a high-level grandmaster. It's just that the price of sacrificing a high-level grandmaster just to assassinate a special physique genius is too high. The dark god's president gritted his teeth and said, I understand that the price is high, but we are already being blamed for failing to destroy Huadong City. If we don't do anything, our dark gods will have to bear the consequences. This, the demon race and the insect race are too unreasonable. Who would have expected a peak-level supernatural expert to appear in the Huadong city, the black figure couldn't help but say. Humph, when have the demon race, the insect race, and the other foreign races ever been reasonable? If not for the fact that our dark gods are still useful, they wouldn't have helped us. The dark gods president shook his head. All right, arrange this as soon as possible. We have to succeed no matter what. Yes. A week later. In a bar in the north district of the Huadong city. The lights were dazzling and bustling. More than 40 students from Chu City High School's focused training class were all gathered here. Because Zhou Hao and the others were going to the frontline fortress base of the Spatial Rift tomorrow, Instructor Shen had specially reserved this bar tonight for all the students to send the eight of them into the elite training camp. Come, Zhou Hao, let me give you a toast. I hope you can let bygones be bygones if I have offended you in the past. Wang Ming raised his glass and looked at Zhou Hao. Zhou Hao also smiled and raised his glass before drinking it all. Nice. Zhou Hao, let me give you a toast too. I wish you the best in your new class. Zhou Hao, here's a toast to you. Actually, I've always been jealous of your relationship with Su Ling, but I've gotten over it now. Only you, Zhou Hao, are worthy of Su Ling. Let's drink away all the grudges of the past. Zhou Hao, I used to look down on you. But now, you are someone I aspire to become. Ha! Many students from the training class walked towards Zhou Hao and proposed a toast. Zhou Hao also drank with them one by one, their grudges disappearing. After all, he was going to the frontline fortress base tomorrow. In the future, there would be very few opportunities for them to see each other. No matter how many grudges they had, it was meaningless. Therefore, everyone could relax tonight. Su Ling, Yun Yan, and Fang Yu, the three beautiful students, also stayed together to drink. The topics of their discussion were naturally different. Su Ling, tell me honestly. Have you and Zhou Hao, after drinking some wine, 
Yun Yan's face turned red. Su Ling blushed. What? We've only held hands. Fang Yu said in surprise, no way. I thought you had tried it. Yun Yan drank another cup and became even more drunk. Fang Yu, Fang Yu, stop talking about Su Ling. Aren't you also a virgin? Screw you, Yun Yan. I'm at least the same as Su Ling. I've held hands with a boy before. I bet you haven't even held a boy's hand before, right? Fang Yu curled her lips. Yun Yan was drunk. Who, who told you that? I've held a boy's hand before. Last time in the virtual environment, didn't we all hold hands together? Su Ling and Fang Yu rolled their eyes. How can that even count? Boom. Just as the three of them were about to rely on their drunkenness to dig up more exciting gossip, a terrifying pressure enveloped the entire bar. All the students immediately felt difficulty breathing, and some even fainted. Swoosh. A figure rushed towards Su Ling like a burning flame. Chapter 142, An Urgent Situation When Zhou Hao saw this, he trembled. He immediately understood that this person's target was Su Ling. Su Ling, run. As he shouted, Zhou Hao did not care about exposing his identity. He directly activated his ordinary standard armor and flashed in front of Su Ling. Bang. He and the fiery figure instantly exchanged blows. The two of them did not have any fancy movements as their fists collided. The terrifying and powerful forces collided and exploded with a strong sonic boom. The sound was like rolling thunder, sweeping up layers of air waves that spread out. Bang. 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 A violent wave of air swept out, sending Yuan Chen, Yun Yan, and the others flying. If not for Zhou Hao separating a portion of his aura to protect them, the wave attack alone would have severely injured them. It's, it's a grandmaster level expert. He's definitely a grandmaster. The Dark Gods. This grandmaster's aura is cold and sinister. There's a 90% chance that he's a grandmaster of the Dark Gods. Quick, inform Commander Zhao. Yuan Chen, Yun Yan, and the others recovered from their shock. All of them struggled to get up and hurriedly informed Instructor Shen and the higher UPS of the city. Su Ling, are you alright? After informing them, they hurriedly ran to Su Ling, who had fallen to the ground. The Dark Gods Union's Grand Master's first target was Su Ling. Even though Zhou Hao had reacted in time and blocked in front of Su Ling, the impact of the terrifying aura still made Su Ling's body tremble. P.U. Su Ling spat out a mouthful of blood and gradually opened her eyes. I, I'm fine. I just suffered a little shock. Yun Yan immediately grabbed Su Ling's wrist and heaved a sigh of relief. She's fine. It's just that her blood essence is surging. Hearing this, Yuan Chen, Yun Yan, and the others finally relaxed. At this moment, Zhou Hao, who was wearing standard armor, had already rushed out of the bar with the Dark God's assassin and was fighting in the sky. The aftermath of their battle destroyed many buildings. Just as Zhou Hao was about to use Senior Zhou's identity to instantly kill this assassin, Commander Zhao, He Biao, Zhen Hong, and the other Grand Masters sensed the combat aura and rushed over. Not good, it's a high-level Grand Master of the Dark Gods. It's the Dark Gods again. Quickly inform Senior Zhou. It's that hidden genius from Chu City High School. I didn't expect his strength to have reached such a level. The moment Commander Zhao and the others saw this Grand Master, they immediately sent a message to Senior Zhou. At the same time, they stared intently at the battle between Zhou Hao and the high-level Grand Master of the Dark Gods. Zhou Hao, who had received the distress signal, smiled bitterly. How could he pretend to arrive as Senior Joe now? Looks like I still have to get involved with my other identity. Thinking of this, he simply used the powerful secret technique Shadow Seven Sabers. Chi. His body quickly flashed as a stunning saber beam appeared. The high-level Grand Master of the Dark Gods immediately revealed a shocked expression. 
Facing this shocking saber move, he was unable to react at all. Soon, a bloody mark appeared on his forehead. You, you're actually that, that. Before he could finish speaking, his body smashed heavily onto the ground, and his aura gradually dissipated. Silence surrounded the bar. Regardless of whether it was Yuan Chen, Yun Yan, or the other grandmasters, their eyes were filled with disbelief. After all, this dark god's assassin in front of them was a true high-level grandmaster level expert. Even though the strength of the dark god's grandmasters was generally weak, they were still high-level grandmasters no matter how weak they were. If it was a supernatural expert like Senior Zhou who had killed him, they would not be surprised at all. However, the person who killed the assassin was. Wait. Seeing that the man in standard armor was about to leave, Commander Zhao hurriedly shouted. Zhou Hao turned around and deliberately asked in a hoarse voice, What's the matter? Commander Zhao took a deep breath and said, Are you a student of Chu City High School? Yes, Zhou Hao said slowly. Upon hearing this confirmation, Commander Zhao, He Biao, and the other grandmasters became excited. Indeed, this person in front of him was really the hidden peerless genius of Chu City High School. Moreover, his strength had actually reached the point where he could kill a high-level grandmaster level expert. This rate of improvement was simply terrifying. In comparison, a special physique genius like Su Ling was a lot less impressive. Even if her potential for growth was very high, was still inferior to this peerless genius. Student, the frontline fortress at the Spatial Rift is currently establishing a global elite training camp. If you're willing, we can guarantee a spot for you to enter so you can be nurtured, Commander Zhao hurriedly said. Zhou Hao replied in a hoarse voice, Sorry, I prefer to be alone. With that said, he turned around and left, his figure quickly disappearing. Chapter 143, Blood Poison Centipede Looking at Zhou Hao's back, Commander Zhao could not help but sigh. We already owe this peerless genius a lot of favors. Unfortunately, we can't help him at all. Moreover, if such a peerless genius is nurtured, his growth will be even faster. He Biao shook his head and said, Commander Zhao, such a peerless genius can't be taught in the training camp. Moreover, he should already have a better master. That's right. Only Senior Zhou can teach such a stunning saber beam, Zhen Hong said with a sigh. Commander Zhao was stunned for a moment before coming to a realization. Looks like Senior Zhou doesn't want us to know his relationship with this peerless genius. In a ruined bar, Yuan Chen, Yun Yan, and the other students watched the peerless genius leave with mixed emotions. This was the true peerless genius who could suppress his peers. Originally, they couldn't help but feel a little proud after obtaining a spot in the elite training camp and entering the top 10. However, now, this pride had disappeared. At this moment, Commander Zhao and the other grandmasters walked into the bar one after another. They looked at Yuan Cheng and the other students. Stepped forward and asked in concern, How are you guys? Are you guys injured? Commander, we're all fine, but most of the students have fainted from the shock. Some of them even suffered minor injuries, but they're currently fine, Yuan Cheng hurriedly replied. Commander Zhao nodded. That's good. Before he could finish speaking, Su Ling, who was standing beside Yuan Cheng and Yun Yan, spat out a mouthful of blood. Su Ling, what's wrong? Yuan Chen, Yun Yan, and the other students were shocked and hurriedly helped Su Ling up. Zhou Hao, who had just returned, heard the sound and rushed over. He flashed in front of Su Ling and said anxiously, Su Ling, don't scare me. What happened to you? As he spoke, he divided his blood essence and quickly extended it into Su Ling's body. He followed her blood vessels and quickly found a long, thin insect that was similar to a centipede. Zhou Hao's expression changed as his domineering blood essence directly enveloped the centipede insect and forced it out of Su Ling's body. Commander Zhao and the other grandmasters' expressions changed drastically when they saw the centipede. This is a blood poison centipede. 
they can silently enter the blood vessels of the human body and release their poison. They are extremely harmful to martial artists. Damn the dark gods. They're trying to destroy Su Ling. One by one, the Grand Masters were furious. Zhou Hao hurriedly asked, Commander Zhao, is there an antidote for the blood poison centipede? Commander Zhao sighed. The blood poison centipede is one of the ten great poisonous insects of the demon race. It has an intense poison. Although there is an antidote for the poison, it's still very hard to find. This is because the antidote grows in the spatial rift and is extremely difficult to find. There was once a supernatural expert who was ambushed and poisoned by the blood poison centipede. He went to the spatial rift to find the antidote but did not succeed. Moreover, before he died, he told us not to go to the spatial rift. That's why I said that it's hard to find. Zhou Hao asked in a deep voice, Commander Zhao, I want to know what the antidote is. No matter how difficult it is, I want to find it. Commander Zhao could understand Zhou Hao's mood. Although he knew that it was impossible to find the antidote, he still said, I'm not too sure about the exact details. Only a powerful supernatural expert knows the name and exact location of the antidote. When you go to the frontline fortress base of the Spatial Rift, you can ask the Dean of the Training Camp. Commander Zhao, if we don't find the antidote, how long can Su Ling last? Zhou Hao asked. At most half a month. Commander Zhao shook his head. But don't worry. Su Ling is a special physique genius. I'll send the news to the supernatural experts. I believe they have the ability to let Su Ling live longer. Zhou Hao heaved a sigh of relief. Half a month was not a short period of time for him. After all, with the Golden Crow escape technique, he could move thousands of kilometers in an instant. Moreover, with his strength, even if he entered the spatial rift, he should be able to stay alive. However, before figuring out the antidote and its location, he wouldn't rashly enter the spatial rift. Not long after, the other students who had been knocked unconscious woke up one after another. They also quickly learned that Su Ling almost got assassinated by a high-level Grand Master expert of the Dark Gods. Fortunately, the peerless genius of Chu City High School was present and protected their lives. However, Su Ling had been poisoned by the blood poison centipede and only had half a month to live. Zhou Hao, don't worry. Commander Zhao said that he'll get the help of a supernatural expert. That's right. A supernatural expert will definitely have a way. There's no point in panicking now. Don't worry, Su Ling will definitely be fine. The students of the training class consoled. Soon, instructor Shen and Su Jenkuo arrived at the bar. Daughter. Seeing Su Ling's dispirited expression, Su Jenkuo's eyes turned red. Instructor Shen's face darkened, his eyes flashing with anger. Zhou Hao said firmly, Uncle Su, I'll find the antidote. Even if the spatial rift is incomparably dangerous, I'll still find the antidote and bring it out to save Su Ling. Zhang Yi patted Zhou Hao on the shoulder. I'll go with you. Chapter 144, To the Spatial Rift Fortress Su Jenkuo had already understood how terrifying the blood poison centipede was and how dangerous it was to find the antidote. For Zhou Hao to make such a promise, he could tell that Zhou Hao was extremely courageous. Good child, Ling Er was right to have picked you. The next morning. Outside the east station of the Huadong city. One after another, ferocious king-level demon beasts stood together. On their backs were Zhou Hao and the other eight students who were headed to the Spatial Rift Fortress base, as well as some Grand Master level experts from the Fortress base and Han Piyu. Many students from the training class, the school leaders, and instructor Shen looked at them with reluctance. Zhou Hao's parents also reminded Zhou Hao to watch out for his safety. Mom, Dad, don't worry. With a supernatural expert and a Grand Master level expert protecting us, nothing will happen to us on the way. We also have these king-level demon beasts. Zhou Hao consoled. Wang Shiyun looked at Su Ling, whose face was slightly pale, and whispered, 
son, Su Ling is a good girl. You can't abandon her just because she's poisoned. Zhou Hao did not know whether to laugh or to cry. Mom, am I that kind of person? Zhou Suiwo also reminded, a person has to finish what he started. Of course, you have to act according to your capabilities. Don't push your limits. Zhou Hao was speechless. Got it? On the other side, Su Jenkyo's eyes were still filled with tears. Last night, he did not sleep at all. If not for the prohibition of casual entry to the frontline ripped fortress base he would have definitely abandoned everything and accompanied his daughter there. Ling Er, don't worry. Even if I have to go bankrupt, I will find the antidote for you. Although Su Ling's face was pale, she had gotten much better after last night. Dad, I'm fine. Besides, didn't Senior Han say last night that he would get the Dean to examine me personally when we arrive at the elite training camp? I believe there will be a way. Su Jenkyo nodded. The Dean of the elite training camp was a true super expert. Such a figure definitely had a way to save his daughter. Ling Er, take good care of yourself along the way. That brat Zhou Hao is fine, but that's only if he dares to enter the spatial rift and help you find the antidote. If he does that, I'll be completely relieved to hand you over to him. When Su Ling heard this, her pale face turned red. Dad, what nonsense are you talking about? Su Jenkyo forced a smile. Going to the frontline fortress base was supposed to be something worth celebrating over so he did not want to ruin his daughter's mood. My daughter has grown up. It's time for me to let go. When you get to the fortress, remember to take time to tell me that you're safe. I will. At this moment, Han Piyu, who was sitting on the back of a king-level demon beast, slowly said, Let's go. Roar. One demon beast after another stood up with a low roar. Go home. Zhou Hao and the other eight students waved their hands. Instructor Shen and the students of the training class watched as the king-level demon beasts left. They knew very well that they would probably have very few chances to see each other in the future. The journey from the Huadong city to the frontline fortress was more than a thousand kilometers. Fortunately, the speed of king-level demon beasts was not slow and they only needed three days to arrive. However, because there were a large number of wilderness areas along the way and many foreign races such as demon beasts and insect beasts were everywhere, the time would be extended once an attack happened. Han Piyu drank a small cup of wine and lay comfortably on the demon beast's fur. Little girl Su Ling, don't worry. Although the poison of the blood poison centipede is intense and the antidote is difficult to find, you will be fine. After all, you're different. A special physique is extremely effective against poison. As long as you can advance to the Grand Master level, you can rely on the blood in your body to suppress the spread of the poison. It won't be a problem for you to live. Su Ling bit her lip and could not help but ask, Senior Han, but, but I only have half a month. Han Piyu pursed his lips. That's only if you have no one around to help you. However, don't forget that you're a student of the training camp now. The dean won't give up on you. Yu and Cheng couldn't help but ask, Senior Han, is the dean very powerful? Nonsense. Han Piyu said angrily. Take these king-level demon beasts we're riding for example. The dean can destroy them with a single breath. The eyes of Yu and Chen, Yun Yan, and the other students lit up. Su Ling's eyes also revealed hope. Such an expert would definitely be able to suppress the poison in her body. Chapter 145, Are You Sure You Want to Choose Number 1? On the way, Han Piyu occasionally chatted with them about the situation in the fortress base, allowing Su Ling and the others to have a rough understanding. There are no residents in the fortress base. There are only students, soldiers, and martial artists. Unlike the Huadong city where you stay, all the resources in the fortress base require points to be purchased. You will know when you enter the training camp. In short, points are very important. 
Outside the defensive line of the fortress base is the battlefield at the edge of the spatial rift. It's commonly known as the foreign race battlefield a euro in the past, the places where we fought the foreign races were inside the spatial rift. But now, the battlefield has been transferred to the outside of the spatial rift. Moreover, the scope of the battlefield has been shrinking more and more. Some of the battles have even spread to the defensive line of the fortress base. As he spoke, Han Piyu's tone became solemn. The living space of us humans is getting smaller and smaller, and the situation is getting more and more serious. That's why we have this new global elite training camp. The goal is to nurture more experts. The expressions of Zhou Hao, Su Ling, and the others were also incomparably solemn. They could sense the huge pressure from Han Piyu's words. Facing the attacks of the foreign races, it was becoming more and more difficult for the humans on Earth to persist. If they lost the fresh blood, then the final outcome of humanity would be annihilation. Han Piyu glanced at Zhou Hao and the other students and suddenly smiled. Don't feel pressured. Right now, there are still us old guys holding the fort. Your mission is to train well and increase your strength. When we can't hold on any longer, it'll be your turn. Han Piyu was smiling, but Zhou Hao, Yuan Chen, Yun Yan, and the others were silent. Three days passed in the blink of an eye. Along the way, other than being attacked by some insect beasts, they did not encounter any other accidents. The main credit went to these king-level demon beasts. Their aura pressure had reduced a lot of trouble. At 9 a.m. on the fourth day, the group arrived at the West Station defense line of the front-line fortress. Zhou Hao, Yuan Chen, and the other students were stunned as they looked at the wall that was thousands of meters tall and completely made of special metal. Haha, <laughs> I was also shocked when I first arrived at the fortress base. This defensive wall looks shocking, but in fact, its defense ability is very weak. The true defense line is inside the base. The wall is completely built with energy and is more than 10,000 meters tall. Han Piyu smiled and jumped to the ground. Then, he walked to the defense line checkpoint of the West Station. The soldiers at the checkpoint seemed to know Han Piyu and bowed. Soon, Han Piyu waved his hand at Zhou Hao and the others. All of you, come down. Swoosh. Swoosh. Zhou Hao, Yuan Chen, and the other eight students all turned around and got off. The king-level demon beasts they were riding on also turned around and left. With the special chips, Han Piyu was not worried about them escaping. All of you, follow me closely. The checkpoint outside is not strict, but it's extremely strict inside. Even I have to go through layers of checking gates. Han Piyu reminded. Zhou Hao and the others nodded heavily. After crossing the first line of defense. Just as Han Piyu said, as they entered the defensive wall, the checkpoints became stricter and stricter. Even Han Piyu had to register his identity. The eight students who had entered the fortress for the first time even recorded all the information. Moreover, the soldiers at the checkpoint even made several phone calls to confirm before letting them in. Other than the demon race, the insect race, and the machine race, there are other foreign races. One of them is called the fiend race. They can mimic any form of life and infiltrate our human city. Therefore, every checkpoint has a special aura scanning device. This device can differentiate humans from foreign races to prevent any spies from infiltrating the base. Han Piyu saw the confusion of Zhou Hao and the others and explained. Zhou Hao and the others finally understood. Yuan Cheng couldn't help but ask, Senior Han, are the exit checkpoints also this strict? Han Piyu smiled. Of course not. However, to leave the fortress base, one has to at least have the strength of a grandmaster. In front of you is the last checkpoint. After this checkpoint, I'll bring you to the training camp to report. You guys all have good results and will be provided with single villas. Zhou Hao, Su Ling, and the others were stunned. Single villas. That's right. Han Piyu looked at Zhou Hao and the others and smiled. 
Don't tell me you guys think you're going to live in a dormitory like the bunk bed. Zhou Hao, Su Ling, and the others nodded. Han Pi Yu immediately left. The conditions of the global elite training camp are naturally not that bad. Even the student rank 60th gets to live in an independent room. A Euro. Half an hour later. Zhou Hao and the others took Han Pi Yu's car and arrived at the entrance of the new elite training camp. The seventh global elite training camp. Looking at the name displayed beside her, Yun Yan could not help but ask, Senior Han, does that mean that there were a total of six elite training camps before? Han Pi Yu nodded. That's right. This is something that has been established in the past hundred years of the cataclysm. In the beginning, there was only one training camp, and the students that they recruited were all geniuses between the ages of 18 and 25. Later on, there were gradually five more camps, and the geniuses that they recruited became younger and younger. This school was newly built. As he spoke, he brought Zhou Hao and the others to the reporting area. After filling in the information, he brought them to the dormitory area. There are a total of ten single villas, each corresponding to a number from one to ten. You can choose any villa you want. There are all kinds of daily necessities inside. If you need anything else, you can get help from the school's logistics department, Han Pi Yu said with a smile. After a pause, he continued, in the first month, everything in the school will be provided to you for free. However, from the second month onwards, you will have to use points to buy items. As for how to obtain points, the instructor will tell you when you officially start school. Hearing this, Zhou Hao was the first to speak. I choose number one. Yuan Cheng and Yun Yan were immediately speechless. Zhou Hao, number one represents an extraordinary meaning. Are you sure you want to choose number one? Su Ling kicked Zhou Hao directly. Although she was poisoned, her temper still did not change. 